Hey guys, welcome to this week's roller coaster ramble. As you can see, I'm wearing the TRR shirt. It looks pretty sick. And if you haven't seen yet, earlier this week I did go to the Pleasure Beach, um, and there is a vlog that went online I think yesterday um, from that trip. Um, and actually, I was wearing this shirt in the vlog, so see if you can spot it. I mean, it's not really hard considering I've just told you. I was wearing it. Anyway, without further ado, we're just gonna get straight in to this week's news from around the theme parks. Let's get into the roller coaster ramble. by the name of OWA, is it OWA, OWA, I don't know, but it has been announced to open in Alabama and building of the park has already begun. It's said that it's going to be, it's going to be home to about 20 rides including two coasters, both of which are Zamperla. The first one looks like a clone of Thunderbolt at Luna Park from the flyover which will be on your screens now and the second is a Zamperla spinning mouse, I believe. As cool as this park sounds, they are definitely pushing it with their deadline. The park have announced their opening for May 17th next year, and since construction only started a few weeks ago by the sounds of things, this is cutting it fine. Also something I would really like to put in there, it has been rumoured that Zamperla have got something to do with this park now, that may just be a rumour because Sam Perla have both the coasters and maybe the owners do like Sam Perla for some reason. Um, but, I don't know. Um, tell me what you think in the comments. Lego Land Dubai finally opened this week, giving us the chance to see inside properly for the first time. Watch this quick fan-made video and see what you think. ones we have here in the UK or do you think it's better than any others that you have been to? Tell me what you think in the comments but I've never been to a Lego Land Park and to be fair that does look quite cool. I particularly like the huge city they built out of Lego. You may or may not know that Universal were planning to open another one of their studio parks in Beijing and it was um, planned for 2019. However, it was announced this week that they have had to push that back to 2020 due to currently unknown reasons. However, presuming, uh, presumably it's just construction took longer than they wanted to. Alright then guys, it has been an episode of rather small news and to round it off we have got another smaller story. <laughs> Dutch Wonderland, a small park in Pennsylvania, is said to be getting their biggest coaster to date, named Merlin's Mayhem. Now, 
it is said to be the biggest coaster today, and that is true, but to be fair, it's nothing like you would expect when someone tells you it's their biggest coaster. Since this park is a family park, you may or may have not have heard of it, um, but it will be an SNS coaster. But what kind of SNS coaster? One of the really bad ones? No, actually, it's not one of the really bad ones. Um, it's actually their first ever family suspended coaster. A video has been posted on the SNS official website showing off the model, and it is believed to be the coaster's new layout used in the video. Although that isn't confirmed, have a look here. Alright guys, thanks for watching this week's episode of the Roller Coaster Ramble. As I said before, it's been an episode of rather small news. Nothing major has happened this week. Um, that's about it really. So thanks for watching guys. Tell me what you think in the comments. And until next time, goodbye.